I'm starting to think I'm pretty awful in bed, I'll be honest. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm not confident. I have no idea. As a guy, you, are you good? You know, are you good? Yeah! <laughs> Your voice literally cracked as I asked. in the eyes right there. Just, oh, it depends if she's awake. I don't know what she's <laughs> We don't know. Because no one's honest with us. We've all had sex. They haven't been told to their face they're bad at it. No. And let's be honest, some of us are probably awful. There are probably guys in this room who have sex like this. They don't <laughs> I just wish there was a way you could know. I wish you could like bang a robot and get a printout. You know what I mean? With sex. You ever in a situation? You ever in a position about to have sex with somebody and you can just tell they're bringing way more skills to the table than you're personally ready to deal with? You're getting naked, she's stretching and shadow boxing. You're taking off your pants, she's putting on a headband with a Japanese sunrise. A lot of neck cracking. Sometimes you just know you're out of your league, right? You get in the bed and you feel like the one white sprinter in the Olympics. Like, this is sex. Here's a true story from the big city. This is really happening. This is how out of my league I got. True story. Met a girl recently at a comedy show, which you should never do. Although tonight, it's snowing. It's probably okay. Uh, no, true story. Met a girl at a comedy show. She came back now. I swear to God, this happened. She got naked. Looked down. She had night cuts. Or like, night cuts. I don't mean cuts. Like, oh, were you an athlete? I mean cuts. I'm like, oh, were you a ninja? Like, you're the serious. I said to her, do you cut yourself? She goes with a straight face. She said, no, I like to be tied down and have a guy drag a knife blade along my body. She said, it doesn't make you bleed, it just makes the skin rise up. First of all, <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> 2010, I'm not trying to get AIDS and salmonella on a Friday night. <laughs> Secondly, she was only 20. I'm like, if you need that when you're 20, when you're 40, you're like, can you just set me on fire real quick? <laughs> You never know. Sex means something different to everybody. I say sex means doggy style, but to Frodo, it could evolve a dog. That's a big deal. Right? <laughs> oh, bestiality is an uncomfortable topic for a university, but let's give it a shot. Um, <laughs> don't you think the implications of bestiality are always dependent upon which animal is involved? <laughs> think about it. You see a guy having sex with a dog? Gross. Do you see a guy having sex with a lion? Freaking awesome. <laughs> you see a guy having sex with a lion? Is that bestiality or the X Games? I have no idea. 